Hey loves, what's going on? It's me. How are ya? Well, excuse my hand and everything. Okay, I think we're good. Well, anyway, I wanted to make a quick video because this is the finished product of me twisting my hair. This is the first time I ever did this before. Um, I wanted to do this because I started going to the gym a bit more so i was just like you know what and plus the weather is getting cool and me and washing goals at this time you know are not good friends um i usually do washing goals from like may to september and it's now october so i'm done with washing goals up until the weather you know breaks again you know, being that I live in New Jersey, it gets kind of chilly and your hair gets dry and all that good stuff. So, I figured at least if I was to do my hand twists, it would be easier to moisturize them while they are still, you know, within the twist. And just rock them. I can do a lot of things with them, pin them back like that and put them all back. So, I said, why not? Um, I'll do a quick turnaround for y'all. I did my best. I'm like I said, this is the first time I'm doing, you know, twists in in my hair like this. So I'm gonna do a quick turnaround for you. Um, it took me um wet on my side. It took me about um three well, two and a half hours to do this almost three hours um so i like them um what i will do before i go to bed is i'm gonna put a not a towel a t-shirt while i'm sleeping because right now i gotta be like almost 10 o'clock or past 10. Um, so, like I said, I made, in the previous video, I made my own flaxseed gel. And, uh, if you guys really, you know, this is just a ice cream container, but this ice cream, Lord have mercy, is the truth. Oh my God. It's like gelato is delicious. Well, anyway, I made my own flaxseed gel. And... Pretty, it's pretty dope. You know, oh, I, I forgot to get bring the flax seeds that I bought. Hold on one second. I'm back. So, I bought these whole brown flax seeds from TJ Maxx. This whole bag was $3.99. Do you see that? And how I made it, I used two cups of two cups of water to one fourth cup of flax seeds, which you can make less because this is a lot. They said that the flax seed lasts for like three weeks or something like that, but you have to keep it in the refrigerator. So yeah, so in the flax seeds, what I did, I put it in the water, put it in the two cups of water, boils it, kept stirring it. And once you see like the mucus, looking stuff happening just take it off and then i used the strainer and strained it and i could have gotten more um i seen nap naturals 85 she used uh some pantyhose to strain it which would be a good idea but this is my first time making it um, I'm gonna put some right here. Yeah. 
slick down my little edges so yeah like it's a natural you know alternative to gel like I was saying my edges is finally growing back from you know postpartum like they're they grow in good I don't know if it was the Shea Moisture Black Castor Oil um, edge treatment or it grew on its own. I know I noticed it. Like once I started using it. So, yeah. So what I got <laughs> in my flaxseed, I got some, I got some rosemary essential oils um lang lang rosemary lavender i put some vitamin e oil in there which is behind the phone so i can't get it and i put some castor oil and i mixed it up and that was that so my hair will have this common effect when I'm at work and I'm stressed. Smell it because of the lavender. So anywho guys, so what I did, like I said before, prime my hair off, put some of this Shea Moisture Black Castor Oil leave-in conditioner and then followed up with the flaxseed. And I was twisting my hair. And like I said, it took like what? Like two and a half, three hours to do it. Or whatever so yeah what do you think I like it it will be very it's going to be helpful because I'm you know I can get a few extra minutes of sleep without having to worry about my hair but yeah this is pretty dope I wonder how long they're gonna last before they start locking probably keep them in for like two weeks three weeks um that wash and go, the last wash and go that I did, I had it in for a month. I'm just washing and doing my hair since that wash and go. Yes. <laughs> Cause I was sick and when I, I can't, when I'm like semi sick, I cannot wash my hair because I will get worse. So guys, that's it. I'm about to get ready for bed. Like I said, my hair is still damp. This side is still damp being that I just finished. What I will do is um get a t-shirt, wrap a t-shirt around my head like this so it can suck the water out of it, being that it's still wet. And oh yeah, my ends look very good. Like I said in the last video, I wore the beanie to, to work because... I got in the house late Sunday, and I was just like, it would be entirely too late to wash this conditioner out my hair, so I went to work. Um, the conditioner that I used was the Shea Moisture Deep Treatment and the 10-in-1 Fruit Complex Mask. Mm, I don't think I would do that again, because it made it a little hard. I still mix my oils in there like I usually do, but... I don't think it's a good idea to mix those two masks together. Um, so yeah, guys, that's that's it. You like? I like. So thank you so much for watching. Um, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. If you have any questions, leave them down below. And thanks for watching. And oh yeah, it's Infant Loss Awareness Month. Um and breast cancer awareness month so think pink think pink but also think blue add a little blue into it um for all the women who's dealt with infant loss and lost babies or infertility problems blessings to you and blessings to all and always be true and always be you and i'll talk to you guys later take care